So let's begin with a look at API lifecycle management. Right? This is all about streamlining the people and processes of APIs. So you've got the ability to create uh, APIs and orchestrate them, give them the functionality that's needed. Right? Uh, then you've also got a catalog that's a repository for the APIs, as well as a place to manage uh, the API stages from publishing through retirement. Right? And all these are important for the lifecycle management, basically, of APIs. Then there's DevOps, right, the technology that uh, certainly enables continuous uh, deployment and continuous integration, and uh, all of these capabilities are supported through DevOps as well. We also embody an API approach, API-first approach. And this is where APIs basically are, are delivered and engineered before any of the applications that use them. This is what we've done with our tools. And so we have APIs for each of these functional areas that you can use to customize the management process. Right? And then lastly, there's a developer portal. Uh, as was mentioned earlier, a developer portal is really all about developer adoption. And so it's critical to helping developers get up to speed quickly, giving them that very fast time to you know, response from an initial request, uh, providing them with a community that they can interact with, and enabling them to discover, consume, build, and test APIs easily.